away. All right, now we're back, and this should be working as intended. Turn my PS5 off. Uh, it's I guess we just kind of have to watch this again real quick, but, yeah. you know. Yeah, no, I'm good. I'm good. It's Mia. She's not dead. She's alive. She, she's back. They found her? How? What happened? I don't know. Look, I don't know how, but she's back. She's back somehow. Maybe it's a prank. She wants me to come and get her. Where is she? Dolby. Dolby, Louisiana. I know, I know, but what if it is her? I have to find out what happened. You should really listen to your friend, Ethan. Like, this is not, not worth the trouble you're gonna be going through, man. But yeah, I should have fucking known better than trying to use the, uh... Use a Microsoft Store version of this, because of course it's fucking ass. But I don't, I don't know what it is, because it's like the borderless window by default. That was like messing with the, uh... It was like super fucking with the frame rate with the capture. Alright, find Mia. So you give me one. Yeah, I don't know why I'm getting so much more of a glare on my glasses now, but... Guess that's what I get for wearing glasses. <laughs> Join us, sewer gators. Oh, yeah, I forgot about the whole videotape thing. It's kind of funny, the demo they put out for this is actually a segment that you play through in the main game, but it kind of works as its own little isolated thing. Yep, there's there's Jack just walking on by. Of course, as soon as he turns a corner, disappears. Where did he go? I get this, this is supposed to be Louisiana, I think, but this is just a weird fucking place to put a house in the middle of fucking nowhere. And they admittedly have they they admittedly have a very big property. They have the main house, they have the old house, they have this whole fucking fucking bayou, freaking freaking boating area. Here's a cow and many cow legs. But there's no real danger over here, so we're fine for right now. Oh yeah, no jumping allowed. But uh, this is... Is this where the game ends right here? No, it must be on the other side. But I don't know what it is when I was playing the Resident Evil 8 demo yesterday. It's something about first person Resident Evil is just so much fucking scarier than third person. <laughs> well, I say I don't know, but I know pretty well what the reason for that is, and that's just first person lends itself to uh, being a scarier experience. It's locked. Let's see. Torn up letter. No real info. It's 
need a lock pick for that or something. Oh, fuck! Fuck! You know, I think I need to turn the brightness on my light down. My glasses. There we go. I can deal with this. Nice and appetizing. Over twenty, over twenty missing in two years. Some real. Texas Chainsaw stuff, and it's actually funny because the developers admit they took super heavy influence from uh, the uh, Texas Chainsaw movies. In tone, the especially the, like the dinner scene is like super straight up rip, ripped out of uh, Texas Chainsaw. Here's some. Mm, oh, mannequins are not here. Is that upstairs? I'm not responding. Here's a videotape, which we don't need if you know what you're doing. But we're gonna go ahead and go through it anyway because it's fun to. I don't think you ever find out what's ported up over there because it's supposed to lead over here, so it's probably basements. So that's supposed to be Mia, I think. Lots of fuse. Let's put in that videotape. Find this guy? Give me a break, Pete. Hey, I only work with professionals. Speaking of which, make sure the sound is right this time. I don't want a repeat of Amarillo. That was two fucking years ago. I don't do ADR. Everyone does ADR. I'm not feeling it. Again? Just don't be surprised if we have to make a change. All things considered, uh, pretty shitty to be discussing that kind of thing right in the per front of the person that you're looking to fire. Just like we always do. Try to say the show's name this time, okay? No problem. Tonight on Sewer Gators, another worthless fucking shithole. Happy? Ecstatic. I just showed my girlfriend, um, Grave Encounters 1 and 2, I think like a week rolling? or two weeks ago. Alright, let's go. Um, it's very... Blair Witch, and obviously this is taking it's by inspiration from that. It's locked. After you. So, why are we in hell this time? Yeah, the voice acting on here is, is very What's jilted on purpose, kind of devoid of like haunted? super explicit personality. But I am loving Fuck. it. I was an anchor, you know. Weekend sub, Pete. Not anchor. What's that? Nothing. <laughs> Probably more so, um, the, the douchebag over here has a pretty decent, well, not decent, channel. but, you know, well-acted personality. The usual. How long do you say this place has been abandoned? Three years. <coughs> Clancy, get a shot of this. Let's make a great cutaway. All right, I, it's supposed to be so, uh, this guy that disappears. I want to try to keep an eye on him. The Bakers, Jack and Marguerite Baker. And they were quiet, not backward. A lot of bad rumors about their it son, Lucas. It is super fucking dark. Bad Holy shit. Apparently. So where ah, are you going? Shit. I know I should have worn my good shoes. 
Oh, I, you actually can't walk over there. Oh, I never knew I, that. Glad I had my shot. Although, this would make a great backdrop. Andre, what do you think? Andre? I would imagine if you're coming Andre. out to do a shoot on these, you should probably bring like Andre. some form of security with Wait, you. you see where Andre went? Especially given the nature of what the fuck you're doing. Where is he? Un fucking believable. This is the last time I work with that guy. I mean, producers, they come and go, but a, a good cameraman like you, Clancy? Yo, oh, fuck you, he's talking shit, <laughs> trying to fire me on the, sp on the spot. See, so it's the room that our character Ethan is currently in. Andre, where are you, man? What the hell? And so yeah, if you already know that the uh, things are right there, um, you don't have to watch this tape. You can just go over to it, pull the thing, and you're advanced in the game already. Which is uh, obviously good for speed runs, but it's also just a nice thing for I don't know regular people looking to play and get caught up to speed on the main gameplay. But I have not played seven in quite some time. So, I'm more than happy to go ahead and go on through this. You first. Need a nice hero shot of me coming down the ladder. So, uh... <laughs> you first. Yeah, no. Do not like, don't want to do that. But, no choice. Why the fuck would you not bring security with you on a shoot like this? Holy you shit. What is you should it? always... And it's not like this is a student project. This is one with, like, supposedly, like, uh, actual producers and whatnot. Uh, I don't see shit because it's dark as hell. Oh. Oh. As much as uh, playability might suffer from using like the proper brightness settings, it it really helps the atmosphere if you do what the Jesus. developers want you to. Jail cell. Bakers. Some kind of noises. Let's go through here. And look, that place that we're going to be so eager to go down now that we know people were murdered down here. Except we don't have a trusty camera. And a shitty ladder. Damn it. But we can see a little better. Okay, so this is where Andre was dead. Oh, uh, the lighting in here is really fucking good. <laughs> Fuck, can't even see where the fuck I'm going. Over here, faint little glimmer. Let's 
Uh, why am I playing this with sur- I already know what the fuck's gonna happen, but playing with surround sound headphones doesn't help. Well, it helps in that it creates a better experience, but for a horror game, much spookier time. So I think that's Andre. Hi, Andre. How you doing, bud? Your eyes looks like a hard-boiled egg. Why am I playing this with such good brightness settings? <laughs> mm, can't open it. I need some kind of bolt cutters. List of people that are dead or have turned. Clancy is L. I know what happens to Clancy, but I don't know what L means. Bolt cutters. I didn't realize it was such a meme that the uh, bolt cutters are overused in 7, 2, and 3. But they are useful. Hey, there we go. It's, it's Mia, the wife. Mia. Oh, thank God I found you. It's me. It's Ethan. Ethan? Ethan? Are you alright? You shouldn't be here. What do you mean? You contacted me. No, no, I wouldn't. Did I? Did anyone see you? Did he see you? Me? Who else is here, Marie? What the hell's going on? Daddy's coming. We need to go. <laughs> daddy? We need to go now! <laughs> Ethan's like, who the fuck are you calling daddy? You know, you go dis you go disappearing. On Ethan, and then you. Where are you taking me? And now so you're calling they, someone daddy. That's not a good sign. Baby, you've been gone for three years. Obviously, the three daddy's years? PTSD do stuff. Has it been three years? Okay, I might have to turn the brightness up just a tiny bit so I can actually see what the is going on there we go so th this is what's actually recommended okay now I can actually see where the fuck I'm walking cool what what is this place what they do to you not now you need to get out of here first I think it's this way oh Thank you for following, Nightbreed Gamer. Much appreciated. It's also appreciated I can see where I'm walking. If it was a movie, I probably would have kept it the way it was, but... Weird little... Bio... Sex. Mia, we have to talk. That message you sent me. Not me. That wasn't me. But you did. I didn't. Okay, fine. Just tell me what's going on. I'm telling you everything that I know. We have to go this way. The brightness got you too, yeah. It's uh, it's like fuck. I I, I really appreciate like the the contrast and everything. Sure but in terms of playability, it, it kind of gets in the way sometimes. I remember. Like, if it was a movie, yeah, I'll stick with it, but at some point I gotta be able to find collectibles and ammo and whatnot. There. It's there. This is it. This is still a pretty good looking game, too. I remember this room. There's another door here. I'm sure of it. It's not here. It's gone. It's gone! We're gonna be a family. 
Let's just say I like plot details that you find out early on and kind of ignore and come back to be super important later. Yeah, this game still looks good. It's not like it came out super long ago. It was 2017. Um, settings are all maxed out and whatnot. Mia. We gotta get out of here. Just stay here, alright? I'm gonna have a look around. Don't disappear. Fucking surround sound headphones. <laughs> Horror movie uh, trope 101. Don't leave people alone for 0.1 millisecond because bad things will happen. Yeah, she just won't listen. It's like it's like she wants bad horror movies things to happen. Although I think that's probably one of my favorite things about Resident Evil is that it knows it's a cheesy B-horror movie and it just like super leans into that. So I am all here for it. First aid. Oh, I forgot you can even do that right now. I'm just grunting the whole time. Oh, now that he's knocking. Man, I am not prepared for Resident Evil 8 because I know where all the things are going to happen here so I can prepare myself, but damn is it fucking scary as shit the first time. Oh god. Eh, I, I don't like this. It... Like a zombie, but strong. Yeah, my first playthrough was pretty blind. I didn't look anything up. But I was just so surprised how much in this opening sequence they're just willing to freaking carve you up and not care. Oh, God. I forgot how gruesome this is. <laughs> Maybe it's because like knives specifically freak me out, but this whole opening's pretty, <laughs> pretty scary. The fuck are you, Mia? Where's the knife? Grab. Why did you throw the knife? Where? Okay. He was first aid. Fuck, where did, where did he put the knife? He had it. He tossed it. I'm just gonna... Nope. Well, you know, I have been playing Valhalla, so I feel pretty prepared to use this. Shit. Hmm. 
Very glad Ethan at least stood up for himself and is not just going to take all these stabbings sitting down. Oh no, she's totally dead. What what are we ever going to do? Let's see. Anything? No. Stay there. <laughs> have come here. Who's this? And what the fuck is going on? My name's Zoe. There should be a way out through the attic. Attic? Go there. Now. Of course there's a door opening and oh magically gone. See, I don't, I don't think it's right here. I think it's the second time he come. Oh shit! I actually got stuck in there. I didn't know it can do that. Guess I never really swung this thing around. Uh, attic, but we don't have power because we need the. Oh no, we have the bolt cutters. Duh. Somehow this is still a faster running speed than in Phasmophobia. It's a very low bar to meet, though. Here's a fuse. So this is the guest house that we're in, right? Yeah. Wait, what was all this called? Oh, they actually have names for all of this. Let's see. Guards area. The cell. They actually have a... C well, cell now. I wonder what it's actually supposed to be used when this thing was just an actual straight-up house. Surgical area. Kitchen, back door. A uh, lock pick for that. I think that's something you come back to... The eater? Or... I don't remember. Oh. Wrong door. And because it's Resident Evil and this series has a fetish with uh it's okay. it's certain okay. tools, uh this beautiful thing's gonna happen. Yank it out, dude. She slammed it in there pretty good, though. Might be better off just tearing your hand off. Or tearing it, you know, your hand away from it. Yeah, she kind of defies, uh... Oh, that is not good. She has, like, a Resident Evil 4 inventory system just pulling chainsaws out of her ass. Where's my hand? I like that hand. <laughs> it's just bleeding out. You should, like, wrap it with something. It doesn't... Like, grant everything in here is pretty filthy, but... Don't just leave the stump out. But I love how it's just right up in your face. Granted, it's kind of blurry, but that's because the uh, depth of field stuff going on. Alright, let's go. Okay, fine. Let's see if we can go 
get some more ammo. No, I think that's all we got for now. For someone with, uh, I don't think Ethan actually has any, like, uh, prior, uh, firearm training or anything like that, so... The fact that he can do what he does in this game is, uh, pretty impressive. Four. I even bother trying to go over there. Gets gun instantly has evil intent against wife, basically. <laughs> Got some. No, I think that's all the ammo I'm gonna get. Which, hey, 30 bullets is nothing to scoff at. That's pretty damn good by Resident Evil standards. Oh, yeah, I should back off. Oh, sh shit. Ch -ch -ch oh, God damn it. She must be oh, shit. Just gonna use this door to my advantage. Nope. <laughs> uh, I kind of backed myself into a corner, though. I'll have to take this hit and oh no I got her I love you too honey <laughs> all right um how'd she get on the roof how'd she get on the roof with a chainsaw not like that matters at the moment I'm gonna back up into a corner because I would like to see how the game proceeds from here. Proceeds, not proceeds. Or maybe it won't let me. Maybe I have to spin around. Yep. Welcome to the family song. And her body moved. That battle went a lot smoother than the first couple times I played the game. Granted, I'm using mouse, so a little easier than the, the purposefully not accurate aiming on the controller. Have work to do. Because staples fix everything. <laughs> Where? Where am I? Very appetizing oh, dinner. Sleepyhead. It's time for supper. <laughs> Who are all you people? Where's Mia? Edith, it's good. Don't some bitch was no good if it hit him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 Hit boy's got to eat. He got to have his supper. Come here, boy. Oh, that is fucking nasty. Oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit, he's not eating the jack! He's not eating it! Get the hell off, Marguerite! for him! Get the hell out of here! You're a son of a bitch! Oh, I can't believe it, you son of a bitch! He's not eating it! He's not eating it! This was a very special beast. Yeah, they really like cutting off limbs. It's a family tradition. Oh, God. I, I don't like knives. And Oh, I 
I really hate knives and knives against teeth and the sound. It's, uh, it's bad. Hi, Grandma. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Alright, so we got nothing. Uh, let's see. Handgun ammo, but no handgun. What was here? Nothing. Is she awake or is she like totally... No, she's awake, staring at me. What's up, Grandma? There should be an herb by the TV. Or I guess where the TV should be, right? It's weird, I could have sworn there was a TV here. It's a TV center. Maybe the herb shows up later. Or maybe it's uh, procedurally generated. Three missing. That was for the crew from earlier. On the ground by the speaker. Not that I see. I should be fine without it, though. I have some level of confidence in myself. Pet collar, those. Oops, wrong key. Um, yeah, those, those those collars are not for pets. Nothing here. A boot. What did it say, Evelyn? Yeah. I love the slow trickle of information you get about, uh, Evelyn. I think I kind of called most of it from, like, as I was playing the first time, but I just love the overall, like, slow progression that you're learning about her. Let's see, I'm gonna need a knife before I can get over here. And... What is it? We need the key over there. Nope. You didn't see me. That wasn't open. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, so I can hear him by the wall. I don't think he actually saw me, so that's good. Okay, he's walking in the kitchen, I think. Open the door. God, I fucking love slash hate surround sound headphones. You don't see me, dude. You do not see me. Oh, you are... Oh, god damn it, he saw me. Yep, that's exactly what I thought I would do. Nope. <laughs> Close the door. Run. Oh, he's gonna bust through though, right? Oh no. Oh god damn it. Fucking yes he did. God damn it. I thought it thought I went too far for it. Go! Nope. Nope, no grabby. I just need that key. Do another run around rotation. Block. Let him walk around the long way while I did he disappear already? Nope. <laughs> I 
<laughs> I love how he's just talking shit the whole time. Fucking prick. Here's a coin. It is funny that he kind of gives up pursuit even though he knows exactly where your only other location could possibly be. Like, he knows the layout of his own house. And, uh, thankfully, um, there are save rooms here, so we don't gotta worry about him coming in here. I don't really have anything in here. Oh, I guess I do have stuff from my other playthrough. But don't need it right now. Keep the handgun bullets, I guess. Camp fluid and herbs. Um. I forget how the fluids work. If I combine it with the herb... Oh, I get like a full on med kit. Okay. And there's like other combinations and you can like put them together to like make ammo. If you did catchy, who would have cut your foot off? Yeah, I've had that happen a couple of times. It's uh, definitely not fun. <laughs> uh, come back for this when I get the knife. How do I. Got the lock pick. Where's the phone at? Oh, the phone's in here. You did good, Ethan. Zoe, right? And what the fuck are you? Shut up and listen if you want to stay alive. You gotta get out of that house. There might be a way out through the main hall. All right. Oh, and that thing on your wrist is a codex. Don't lose it. It's important. Hell of a girl. Yep. I do like the audio cue for these uh, bobbleheads, and now that I'm actually... I think it's probably the first time I've even played Resident Evil 7 with headphones, so... Um, I, I didn't start becoming a dedicated headphone user till. Admittedly, only like last year. But I think it basically improves any game that you're playing. So you need a thingy for that. You don't know him, but you get the feeling he's an asshole. That is far more accurate than you could possibly imagine. There is another one right there. I should be getting the knife right now. Oh, I know that's that. Fucking curtains. There we go. Open up. Hey, you gotta help me. Hold on, back up. Now, sir, do you live here? I mean, is this? Your property? What? Me? No. No. All right. Now, we got several calls about some missing persons lately. You don't understand. I gotta get out of here. Now, calm down. You're not listening to me. The cop's They're being very cautious. If only he had <laughs> exercised the same amount of caution <laughs> very soon. Like you playing with a full deck yourself, all right? Are you kidding me? Look, like I said, we've had several missing persons calls. And I can't rule out that an outsider like yourself may not be involved. Right. I'll tell you whatever you want. All right. Now that's more like it. Now, meet me in the garage. We'll talk there. Hey, wait. You gotta give me your gun. <laughs> you must have lost your mind. Look, officer. Reasonable, deputy. reasonable reaction right. from the officer. Now, do you want to see my name in the obituaries? Or do you want to be a hero and save my life? A fucking pocket knife? Here. Take it. That's all you're gonna get. Now go. Garage. Now. 
What am I smart, do with a knife? Smart enough officer, given the information that he has. Um, he should continue to be smart. What is Ethan going to put in the obituary? He didn't give me his guy. <laughs> If if I was in this scenario, I I would endorse such a statement. Except with the added statement, uh, didn't give me a gun, but at the same time, I can't blame him. Still got that screwdriver hole in his hand. Hey, we gotta get the fuck out of here. Now first, you need to tell me what you're doing out here alone in the middle of the night. Me? What about you? No, it's my job. You do your job and tell me. Just tell him you got kidnapped, Ethan. That, that's kind of the first part. Hey, put that door back. Put that door back up. Wait! <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Gr oh. Jesus Christ. I'm on fire. Shit. All right. You're smashing up my car, dude. Yes. Ah, uh, shit. There we go. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. There we go. Fuck you and the horse you rode in on. Shit. Okay, come on. Hey, he's getting in the car now. Shit. This part is so dumb. This part is so fucking dumb. Oh, no. Oh, fucking Christ. This part is so fucking dumb. <laughs> this is so stupid. I love it though. Oh, these first person games are such a great change for the series. Oh, you know what? I never went back for the bottle caps, but I still have time to do that. Oh boy. Now look what you've done, motherfucker. Oh yeah, I should have grabbed the car earlier. So surely, he's dead now, right? No, no possible way he could survive that. Uh, chem fluid. Oh, that's all I got. Do I have your attention, boy? You're about to see some wonderful. Oh. <laughs> oh, I love this fucking game. Oh, he's, his face is still moving too. He's just waiting for himself to regenerate. It's all molding into himself though. That is a good point. My gun was empty. How did he... Maybe when I wasn't looking, he, he put a single bullet in there. <laughs> I never stopped to think about that. You're totally right. Let's see, shotgun shells, but no shotgun. Let's twist that off. There we go. Alright, so I need to not forget these bobbleheads. Let's 
So let's that let's make that my priority. I think the phone's gonna ring right now though. First aid. Um right now the phone is where again? I don't remember where the fuck the phone is. I could have sworn the phone was... I don't know, maybe I'm... No, no, the phone's in the safe room. That's where it is. Let's stab you. Save real quick. And get that second bobblehead. Did it mark the... Uh... No, it did not mark the thing in the living room. After over 12 playthroughs, you have all the bobbleheads. I don't think I've ever gotten all of them. I have, like, all the trophies slash achievements, whatever, for the Resident Evil 2 and 3 remake. But I never felt the urge for 7, for whatever reason. Car key, I don't... Really, I should actually deposit that now that I think about it. Uh, the car is destroyed. No need for the key for it. But yeah, I think I've played through seven, I want to say like four or five times, something like that. But yeah, never never felt the need to, to uh, get everything for whatever reason. Uh, I don't need that. Chem fluid. Don't need that. I like to run around pretty light. Whoops, wrong thing. Uh, there we go. Because this is a thing that normal people put in their house. Shoot me, shoot me. Stab you. Gunpowder. Antique coin. There's the phone. Did my daddy give you a hard time? That's your father? He used to be. I'm sorry, but he, he he's a he's dead now. <laughs> you just might be able to pull this off. What? Pull what off? There's something I need you to do, but I can't explain it right now. You may need some sort of keys to do it, but find a way out of the house. Okay. I'll be in touch. It's kind of funny that it's strictly this house, the the main house that we're in, that is the most like the original Resident Evil games, finding keys for like these very specific doors and whatnot. Clock pendium, pendulum, pendium. A lot of missing people. I already know what we need to do here. God, I saw the fucking shadow. I'm like, oh, is he upstairs? Then no, it's a fan. Uh, can't get the shotgun without the broken one. Yeah, classic Resident Evil scenario with the keys. And I actually, I really love it. I would say I I love basically this entire game, but if I had to highlight a weaker part, it'd probably be the tanker and maybe the mines, but the mines are so short that it doesn't really stand out. go. Got the dog head. Yeah, no herb there. I remember it just being such a breath of fresh air when 7 came out that Resident Evil was back to being a great franchise and like, I, I really liked 5. I, I really like 6 and that's uh, most people didn't like 6. I really like 6. It's its own cool, dumb little action thing. But seven was like the comeback. <clears throat> Fuck you. Oh, I can't slice you. You're being creepy, though. All right. Maybe it's daddy's hobby. Let's let's not call him daddy. 
Oh wait, there's Marguerite over there. I wonder what would happen if he shot her. Probably nothing. Not like I have ammo to test it. Hand. Uh, I need a lockpick for that. Nothing yet. <laughs> Worth the bullet. Let's see. Marguerite, move that piece of shit hippie we caught from the hall to the processing area. That is a weird thing to have. Nothing. Wait. Mia tapes right there. Storm. Big old book. Blue dog said. Missing one. Gunpowder. And I believe the last one is after the boss fight with Jack. Uh, let me clear this room before I do that. Whoops, wrong key. <laughs> Can't get in here because that's the scorpion key. Yeah, let's go ahead and do the tape. It's kind of weird with so Seven has the stalking enemies with Jack, and then I guess Marguerite does a little bit, but she's like so classified to like those specific hallways. But then they evolved that with Resident Evil 2, the uh, the remake with Mr. X, and then Nemesis was supposed to be an even bigger evolution from that, but uh, Mr. X is kind of the new Nemesis. There you are! You gave us quite a scare, young lady. I wonder if she can actually come up to here. And get you. I hear a. Oh, I thought that was a freaking bobblehead. It's just all these creepy little fucking dolls. Is she actually gonna open the gate? Yes, she is. Shit. Let's fucking go. Nope. I love that's even being hinted in a frickin' uh in an optional content. Like you don't have to do this. I forget, does she come down here? How'd she even get over there? Like, the layout of the map, she's supposed to be, like, right here, but then she popped up over here. What have I done to deserve this except open my home and feed you? I hate these shadows. Just go through the fucking door, lady. Come on, go. I don't understand you at all this. I, I, I fundamentally disagree. Oh, shit. Blow torch. I know for a fact, like, this hiding spot works, but the first time, not knowing if she's just gonna come around the corner and frickin' get you is pretty... Uh, pretty nerve-wracking. I know you and Zoe are plotting. I know you were scared. You think I don't know what you want to do with that boy, Ethan? And from what it seems from Village, they're, like, totally dropping the mold. Like, strain of the virus, whatever you... 
Um, and they're kind of going through their own weird direction with vampires and werewolves and shit. Um, I'm kind of glad it's becoming a bit more of an anthology of like weird shit going on. Oh, don't look this way. Ooh, that part always freaks me out because it looks like she's right about to. She's right there, though. Nope, nope. Just get the fuck out of the room, lady. Come on, go. We open our home. We open our hearts. And what do you do? All right. Now that's out of the way. See, this part's a little odd. There we go. That's about right. Wait, no, I have to. Yeah, that's. Oh, oh, wait, no, I have to hit F when I think it's in place. I thought it was going to do it automatically, but nope. There we go. I have no clue how, how such a puzzle to actually function in reality, but it uh, does look cool. I will give it that. I wonder how much of this is even like a loading screen versus pacing device. She's gonna come around here, right? She loves you. Yep. She wants us to be a family, goddammit. You! You! All you have to do is accept her fucking gift! Oop. Almost nudged out too much. We love you. Why can't you see that? Shit. Embrace us. There are known unknowns here, and you are not Go, 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 go. Ooh. I can try to escape. See, why couldn't Jack do this earlier? So there's Mia and some girl. We don't know who it is, but we can piece it together. Where do you think you're going? <laughs> What did they do to you, Mia? They they took her VHS, her most treasured uh, form of media consumption. <laughs> All right, that door is locked. I th I think you need to interact with them in order for them to get, get marked on the map, though. I have too much shit in my inventory. There's a shortcut here. Chem fluid. 
And that's the thingy. Um. Do I have any herbs? Oh, it just straight up tells you what you can make. Okay. I think I already have a med kit though, so I think I'm good. Or herb, whatever. Not herb, first aid kit. I will make it if I need to. And I believe our good old buddies in here, right? Got three dog heads. I think Jack's supposed to be in here, right? Maybe I need to do more exploring. Ah, uh, this fucking door closes so always scare the shit out of me. Let's see. Yeah, there's nothing I can... I need the stupid... Um... Shadow puzzle thingy. Man, I have not played this in a while. It's probably showing. <laughs> okay, but so I've checked the door. So maybe they'll check it off and now I can search the tub? Apparently not. Okay, I will circle back. Oh, you know what? Maybe I need a. I don't think I need to place the dog heads, but I could definitely do that either way. Yeah, might as well place you guys. But in terms of inventory, um, I don't really have much right now. Kind of like the feature in Ezio's two and three, where it'll tell you if a room is cleared of its items or not. Evelyn. I mean, I kind of pieced some of it together when I was playing the first time, but now that you know, it uh, stands out a lot more. What the fuck else is that shadow piece? Because I know he won't start chasing you until you do that. Oh, the F's right there. The interact, whatever. There we go. And then he's going to be through the door, right? Heck of a thing, man. This sure shit beats the hell out of dying. My little girl has given us a gift. And this gift is with me always. Nope. All right. All right, so I just need to go do that puzzle. Let me see if I can just do it right now. 
Yep, good thing I cleared everything else beforehand. Um, opposite direction. There we go. Who builds this shit? Yeah, it definitely seems like more of a loading thing versus, uh, pacing. Which, hey, I can appreciate it, but I'm on very powerful hardware and it won't necessarily stand the test of time as well as, um... Handgun, camp fluid, and a crow. Hey, buddy. I will say, not a fan of the exploding boxes later in the game. Use psycho stimulants to find items. Uh, I need a lock pick for that. Notes. I was talking about cutting people up, whatever. Oh, whoops, I'm back. Oh! It's showing the our little moldy zombies. Yeah, it's very cool all the molded are actually all there. Victims, basically. That looks so delicious. They look like they all might be victims. Yeah. And one of them's. What the? Nope. Oh, fuck. Can they open. I. I don't remember them being able to open doors. Can they open doors? I don't think this one can, right? Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> Alright, let's drop some stuff off since we're here. Dear Courtney, those bastards are looking for me, but maybe this gives you a chance to escape. To escape, you have to find the relief shaped like dog heads. I saw one of the heads in the dissection room underground. Get it? It's the key out of here. It is literally the key out of here. Something's wrong with me. It must be the shit they made me eat. If I'm going to die, go out fighting. I'm going to get a hold of that shotgun I saw in the rec room and make them regret what they did to me. Very good diegetic hints. I don't have a lockpick. I will take all the handgun ammo I can get, though. Um, here, let's combine shit. Okay, so we can carry a max of three. Store you. Alright. Oh, yeah, I should save. All right, this side should be locked. Hate being able to hear these fucking things. God. Definitely a lot harder with the controller. If this is my if this is my first time. I I well I did play with a controller because I play on PlayStation. But I would say if it's your first time, play with a controller. I would say that's the intended experience. But I have played this many times, so. Not necessarily looking for that same challenge. 
Alright, there should be a hint thing here or something, right? Gunpowder. Is that it? Caught the guy who keeps trying to escape. I've caught him in the left mo in the left motion scenario so he can't get away. Take him out when you're ready. You know how to open the door, don't you? Just remember three A's and a handprint. Do what you want with this do what you want with his girl. Alright, so three A's and a handprint. So we need that one open. That's two A's. One. Wait, how many did it say? Three A's? Yeah. That do anything? Maybe it's William? Oh, that one, Tamara, three A's. Jesus Christ, this is the tougher one. Shit. Blocking is very important. Ah, oh, shit. There we go. Kind of eating through all my ammo, though. What's my health at? I should be fine. And what's my reward? The key. This you don't get so much later in the game. So not gonna bother with that. I believe this is where you're supposed to go next. So we're not gonna go there. I hear foots. No, that's just a fucking fungus mold, whatever. Where do I get the broken shotgun again? You're supposed to use it to get the... Or no, you need the scorpion key. To get the broken shotgun. There is a scorpion key so we can go get some more shit. Treasure photo, we can go back for that. Chem fluid. Shotgun. There you are. Jesus fucking Christ. There we go. Fucking piece of shit. Um, no, I made- I haven't made that shortcut. Let's use that. Actually... Because I could clear this room. But I really want the shotgun. Because it'll make the boss fight a lot easier. But oh, mother! That's what I'm gonna say. It's gonna make the fight a lot easier. But in terms of like speed run, you want to just get it later. But not necessarily worrying about a speed run at the moment. Um, let's get you out of the way.
All right, so let's go lock pick some stuff, get our treasure. Oh, mother fucker. I don't remember there being this many of them so early on. But I guess I remembered incorrectly. Let's see. Lockpick. Shotgun shells. Treasure hunt. Steroids. Transform into uh, Arnold for a minute. Alright, what am I doing? The faster way would be to use the fucking key. Um, well, I did have to come back over, but no way I'm going down that tiny little hallway or whatever. The crawl, not crawl space. You know what I mean. So I don't know if Jack's still roaming around. Well, that answers my question. No, I will. Basically just using these bullets not to kill, but to... Nope. Alright, let's carry up and use this fucking thing. Please don't tell me you saw me. So I just want to collect this shit in peace. That's cool. <laughs> Getting tired of chasing all these shitheads around the yard. The next time one of our guests runs away, hide the dog, head relief so they can't get out of the house. Explicitly tells you where they are. Alright, so I need to see if there's any other place I need that scorpion key. Um, I don't have another lockpick for that. Scorpion key... No, I should be good. I don't even know if I still need it. No. Nope. get hungry again. Let's see if I can. He's going to be right around the corner. Yeah. Yeah, he's going to be behind me. At least his shit talking kind of gives away his position, so that's good. Nice house, if you ignore all the weird contraptions and fucking murder dudes running around. You can't take the shotgun because you have too many items. Um. Fuck you, I, did, I don't have too many items, I disagree. 
I, I have one too many. Why can't I just drop the shotgun on the floor? Okay, let's go to the one over here. This is probably murder on speedruns, but... Oh well. Just deposit some shit I don't need. Well, that should do it. Don't tell me he's over here. Uh, yes he is. Okay. <laughs> it won't be long before I find you and kill you. Just don't open the store and you'll, you'll be good, buddy. I'm not sure if I really like the depth of field effects on here. It makes everything just seem blurry constantly. I I would say your gun should always be in focus, but uh, let's see graphics, depth of field. Let's turn that off. There we go. I much prefer this. Usually I'm a very diehard fan of depth of field, but where's Martin Leeson? Get out of the first floor. Uh, Motherfucker! No, no. God. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, dude. Alright. I need to grab you. Now he can't get me. And now we need to put the broken one. Now that we have that, we can keep going. Do I have everything I need? Yeah, that should be good. It's gonna be a couple of moldy dudes. Shit. Where did. Did you just run off? Ah, damn it. Forgot about you. Handgun ammo. And there's still the one that came out of the wall, right? Where the fuck did you run off to? There you are. Trying to be sneaky. God, I was so fucking terrified of these guys the first time I was playing. Oh. Oh, fuck. There's two of you. Shit. Oh, that's not good. Okay. Shit. Okay. 
I need to heal. I think that's all my healy juice. Alright, so no pistol ammo. Only shotguns. Let's see how well this turns out. I have a lot of ammo, though. Dead cop right up over there, slowly molding over. Shotgun shells. I should be good on ammo. I hope. Should probably make this shit ahead of time. Just to be on the safe side. There's something you gotta love about the sound design of, uh. Yeah, poor deputy. He's got one eye kinda still there. Just chopped off. Um, yeah, so you gotta love about the sound design of it. it's a fucking shotgun. It's just making hella noise as you're running, despite it not clanking up against anything. Anything down here? Gunpowder. All right, let's do this. How is Ethan's shirt still looking this nice? Damn, already? Yes, I do. <laughs> Here, I'm gonna grab one too, buddy. Chainsaw block. Don't tell me about to fuck this up. Ah! 
I don't want to have to do all this all over. Come on, Jack. Let's go, buddy. All right. Uh, glad I didn't die. Stay dead. Cause I neglected to uh, save. All right. So let's get the fuck out of here. Should have just climbed out. Might have been able. To, that's not too much of a pull up right there. Weird area to have in your house, though, I will say. Big ol' weird basement area. <laughs> Oh, wait, no, we can't use this door till much later. think anyone else is gonna spawn so should be good to care the head honcho singing aunt roadie are you I wish I could freaking <sighs> Swing at you. Alright, um. Scorpion key we won't need anymore. Shotgun shells will keep. Did I already put the dog heads in? Yes, I did. Um. I do need health. So let's get that stuff going. Phone for messages, real quick. All right. She's still singing it. I don't like it for a second there. Alright, we are good to go. Chair seems to be freaking out. There's some little hidden secrets around here that we can use. It 
to one crawl space that we can't. We know Marguerite's lurking around here because we saw her earlier. But it's this hatch. And we heard screeching, so that's fun. Parakeets. We can either use for the pistol or the um, shotgun. Do we have enough space for the shotgun? Yes, we do. But that also requires leaving my current shotgun, which has ammunition. So I'd rather wait until there's nothing in it than use it just to uh, maximize on our available resources. Um, there's also a tiny little thing right around here. Which we need a hatchet for. But that won't be until much, much later in the game. Some antique coins. Alley picture. It's too late for them. Bye's feeling weirder and weirder. Soon I'll become like mom and dad. It's all her fault. Should I run? No, I can't. I'm dead if she finds out. This woman, she was with Mia. She knows something. If I had the serum, I could cure myself. I have to find out more. So she's resisting the uh, virus. Um, maybe it's those. Maybe it's Chris's blood. Broken handgun. Let's uh, fix that. Now we have a gun that is not broken. We need our coins. We need to sort these. Uh, I thought I could have sworn I had more. Guess not. There's our new pistol. Let's see. Steroids increase the max health indefinitely. Stabilizer. I can't even read what it says. Reloading speed increased. That could be nice, especially for the shotgun. And this is a magnum. I usually never actually get the magnum. But we can get the steroids right now. Let's just go with this. All of these will help in immensely. But I do want that magnum. Alright, so let's save. Of course as you leave, it fucking rings. I've ever seen make it this far. So what is it you need me to do? Is it going to help me get out of here? Yes. Now listen carefully, Ethan. My family and I, our bodies are contaminated. I can't leave the property unless I get it out. And the same goes for Mia. Is there a way to get it out? We need the serum. It should clear whatever this stuff is out of the body. As long as you're not too far gone. All right. So where is it? If I knew where one was, I'd already be long gone. But I have a feeling my mother has hidden some inside the old house somewhere. So if we get this thing, I can help me and we can get out of here? Right. And so can I. The old house is near the water. You can't miss it. All right. I just hope you can handle my mother. Your mother? Be careful. 
They'll be looking for you. Oh shit, new news development. Microsoft has backtracked on Xbox Live Gold pricing. There will be no price changes. Uh, good. Because that was a shitty thing to do. Um, granted, Game Pass is a is the better value. That's what you should be paying for instead of gold. But uh, Xbox Live, as of right now, doesn't actually do anything for you that you can't get for free on PC, so... I do not like people having to pay to play online. Oh, I have too much shit. Oh, I never even took my new steroids. Health increased. Um, Alright, that should be fine. Let's go drop this shit off. I don't feel like I'll need the shotgun. Or maybe I will. Here's those big old fucking annoying ass bugs. These guys have a lot of money for- so that's already a nice ass house and it has a whole big old creepy fucking dungeon area or whatever. Is there... No, it's not bobblehead. It's a stupid little doll thingies. <laughs> Fucking bugs. Pretty powerful swing to slash it across, though. Must admit. Alright. Um, is that the main way to go? Okay, I really don't want to go past there because that's where the fucked up shit is. Looks like a plan for some sort of flamethrower. Very useful in this area. No creepy girl. She's upstairs, don't go up. Man, both these areas are fucked up. I was about to just mind my own fucking business. They're gonna come after me? Yeah, fuck. That's not. Go that way. They don't do, like, a lot of damage, but it does accumulate over time. So let's go through the area that I can actually zoom past. Shit, come on. What am, I, what am I supposed to do? Like, shit. I do not like those bugs. Uh, I need a lockpick. Uh, you can swipe these spiders away from a safe distance and save yourself the ammo. I just doing it one step at a time. There we go. So I don't want to spend the ammo on these guys. Just want to take a minute. There we go. Chem fluid, strong chem fluid. Lock 
pick. We can use that on this thing right here. First aid. Might need that pretty damn soon. Might as well use one right now. We're gonna need a wench for that. Let's see if we can just zoom past. Stab this bug. Burn our nozzle. Now we just need a thing from the other side. And let's not open that door because I believe that's. Go. Nope. Don't want to deal with that. Mother. It's back up in a corner. There we go. Oh! There's another fucking. Alright, let's not spawn. Marguerite unnecessarily. And of course I don't have any space for anything. Um can I combine anything. Yes. Flame rounds for the grenade launcher. I don't have a grenade launcher yet. There we go. Now we got a burner. This will help. There's a bobblehead. Backpack, so we can carry more shit. Um, don't. I should bring the shotgun. Or shotgun shells, I should say. But let's save. What is it I need? I need a stupid uh, thing to uh, whatever. I believe Margaret's gonna be right behind here. Well, let's get rid of this first. And I can't see shit whenever I'm using that because it. Oh. Shit. There we go. It's fucking dead now. Oh, fuck. Wrong gun. I hear... There you are. Let's see, let's see coin. Let's 
stone statuettes. No more bullshit, Mia. I want some answers. I know. I know. You're right. And I always wanted to tell you. But but I just I can only remember a little and the rest is just gone. <laughs> Dad, right? You mind if I uh, borrow mommy for a little bit? Why don't you stand there? Do something! Ethan, help! Damn it. I mean, we had a gun. We could have tried to shoot him. Alright, now I believe Marguerite will be on the opposite side of that door. And I don't think we necessarily need much from over here, so let's not even bother wasting the ammo. Stay the fuck out! And of course these assholes start coming. Destroy this fucking thing. Count fluid. I think we can actually get rid of these spiders also. Take a while, but yeah, no, let's not go that way. some good ammunition over there. I just don't have any fuel for this thing. Unless I can... Nope, I can make some. So let's get that going. Bug, you're almost there. Just all right, and then fly it quick. I should do it. Nope, still spiders on you. Come on. Fire fuel. Pretty gross. Don't know if you'd want to use that herb. Apparently, Ethan's desperate enough. I think she's to the left. Don't turn around, lady. Close the door. There we go. Or wait, did I not even get the handle for that over there? Do I go back for that? I think so. understand why they make you the same puzzle twice even if you played through it as Mia and uh, at least it's not super, something super elaborate but going through fuck, here fuck, a second fuck, time fuck. is kind of eh
This house is all kinds of fucked up. Let's not go up there yet. Oh, you know what? Yeah, that, here's where the fucking rotating thing was. Because this is where Mia got uh, kidnapped. Why there's a lawnmower down here? I don't freaking know. I'd put... Why would you put the shit in a fucking crawl space? There's a fucking bug over there. Because there's nothing over here except the door, right? Yeah, I think I remember why this one in particular is pretty egregious. Because you have to go through here like a minimum of four times. And then if you add the, uh, the instance where you're playing as Mia, you have to go through here. That's five. So, a little <laughs> redundant. So I am just holding forward. Alright, so we gotta sneak past. Oh, fuck. Can I sneak past you? Can you go the other way? Okay, I think she's going. Trying to find me. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. Jeez. Nope. I'm good. <laughs> oh, I hella shotgun blasted her. That's my fucking siege reflexes right there. Stayed. Crow key, burner fuel, antique coin. I think that should be it. There you are. Ah. What do you mean, there you are? You didn't see me. Yeah, I'm just gonna go this way. Already cleared it anyway. She's upstairs. Don't go up. Well, I'm going to have to. Okay, so she's to the right. So I'm going to close the door on your bitch ass. And skedaddle. So, fifth time we've been through here, but... Good thing that this will be the last. All right. 
right, so let's get ready for uh what's my inventory looking like? I have entirely way too much shit. Kind of a weird boss battle, right. but <laughs> your fucking head real. Here, let's just shotgun your ass. I don't have time for you bugs. So, like, her main attack right now isn't even, like, physical, it's just sending shit after me. Ah, oh, god damn it, reload. Is that enough? Shit. And the game's not giving me any more like handgun ammo because it knows I got plenty of shit. Still can't walk over that area, so it means your body's. Oh, shit. Get up. I didn't know it actually damaged you. Strong thingy. Uh, okay. Probably gonna call the stream soon. They never really explain why it looks like that. Regarding the series Virum, the following items be able to synthesize serum. One D series cranial nerve, two D series peripheral nerve. I think that's it. Okay. Well, did he find a serum? I just got done dealing with your mom and her fucking bugs. Wish you could have warned me. <laughs> Sorry about that. What about the serum? I haven't found any, but I did find out we need to make one. A D-series head and an arm. This can't be right. A head? I think I have that around here somewhere. You do? I don't know about the arm, though. Have you searched the whole house? No, not yet. I still need to check the second floor here. All right. Oh, you Take know what? Out. I forgot how fucking good the, the second it. floor of this house is. It's probably one of the best moments in the game. Um, Is there a... Save room nearby. Probably back at the crows um, thing. Whoops, didn't even check that. Shotgun shells. Oh, I need the lantern, right? See, so, yeah, I need to go back and get her lantern. Because that's not creepy at all. <laughs> It's basically right about this moment Ethan starts being a little bit of a smart ass about the situation, which that's one way to deal with all the trauma you're facing. 
it's not quite on the level of like Leon jokes um, at the situation, but it is pretty damn close. All right, so we I don't have enough space for strong chem fluid. Now we should. Can I not open this? Should. There we go. Alright, so let's um, drop some stuff. We don't. Actually, you know what? There's a grenade launcher I want to do before we stop because I will forget otherwise. I think that's the only other pro thing in the house, though. Grandma's gone. There's nothing on the second floor that needs it, right? Yeah, it's all the snake shit. Okay. Solid fuel, grenade launcher, shotgun, flame rounds. I don't even know what that thing was, but I got it. Let's see. Flame rounds with solid fuel, strong chem fluid. Flamethrower with weaker fluid. Pistol ammo. I imagine I'm going to be getting plenty at least ahead of this encounter. But let's see. Don't need you. Could use you. Nope. Damn, I forgot this thing only takes like one fucking thing at a time. I should probably get any resources beforehand. Um. Yeah, I think that's going to call it just because it's getting late at the house. That's not the safe thing. That's a phone. <laughs> uh, but yeah, thank you everyone for coming by and stopping. Um, if you want to check out my stuff, best place would be Twitter, which is my ads on screen right now. Stay up to date with all my shenanigans, what I'm up to. Uh, Twitter, Twitch, YouTube. YouTube, you can get... Um, get all my content over there i do a podcast game session it's hosted live on twitch sundays at 6 30 p.m it's all about gaming news what we've been playing yada yada uh, that's available live on twitch it's available later on youtube as individual segments and uh, just as well as the full episodes and it's also on podcast services but yeah um, follow me on twitter to stay up to date with everything i do and i did just drop a big game design uh, article on Doom Eternal, which you can find on my Medium, which is linked down below in um, my link tree. So, yeah, you can find all my stuff pretty easy. Like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff helps. Alright, thank you for hanging out. I will see you next time.